Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Adrian Odyssey 2 with me, Boulder McGammer. I took that small break to map out what little I have on this floor. So let's go back to exploring. While walking down a path, you hear a branch snap immediately go onto the fence. A bizarre monster suddenly appears right before your eyes. You wonder how it could have come so close to you without sensing it at all. Take heed. There seems to be monsters in the forest that do not appear on your map. What? Get the huh? What? No. Nah. What? Oh wait, someone warned me about the, the invisible FOEs? No, why? Game. Oh hey, a take spot. Uh, what was take for me again? Oh right, blue. Yeah, I've changed them all. For me, green as chop makes sense because green is the color of trees. As for take and, um, mine, I guess I think of mine as purple for some reason, I don't know. I'm still gonna mark this, though. Because otherwise I'll never remember unless I continue marking them. Take. These things again! Let me face the peril. Let me destroy the peril. We'll put the peril to sleep. There we go. Double cut! Ow. I should probably heal. It's been a while since I've done that. You know what? Auto attack. Hopefully that uh, thing didn't follow me. It didn't look like it did. It looked like it started going in the other direction. Random battles. Lots of them. Just out of attack. What miss? Gosh, your agility lack of? Or lack thereof, I should say. There we go. It's dead. Hmm. This way looks much simpler. A door. I could potentially use this to escape. Okay, looks like it's going the other way. I'm sorry, but that's really scary. Just the thought of it, it's invisible? I mean, I can see it with my eyes, but I can't see it on the map? That's really... Uh, I have to really pay attention, then. This way looks simpler. It's now night. Or dusk or something, I don't know. The door before you was sealed by some mysterious power. You tried to open it, but to no avail. Perhaps some sort of key is necessary to gain entry. Okay, it's not an open door. Closed. Forbid. I said closed. I'm trying to map around it. There we go. This way it is. Now what the heck is that? Mistu. So a mystic statue. Great. Yeah, let's kill this other thing first because I know it's easier. Let's start putting this thing to sleep. Great. I'm not even gonna. Uh, come on. Rock shard. Perhaps it can be used to play some rock. Heavy metal. I don't know. It's a box. Hard aspis. That sounds like armor. No. Armor. Oh, it's a shield. Uh, you can use shields. That's only one strength. But you can't, no, wait, you can't use that shield, can you? Uh, 
2 agility, 11 defense, or 14 defense. I think I'm going to keep the agility, thank you. It helps me hit things. And, you know, slice things before they slice me. Good decision, bad decision? I don't know. Kill. Putting that thing to sleep seems to be a good idea. Very good. A hold rock. I guess I got that because I killed it with the pierce attack. Let's see, is that enemy right there? Oh, it looks like it's going around that way. Okay. Keeping that in mind. Okay, it looks like there's a path up there, but I don't think that'll go anywhere. some little giant tree thing there, and another one right there. This wall only goes over so far. Which way is that thing going around? Oh! There's another one up ahead! Okay, I see, I see. Man, this lag is killing me. Yeah, this looks like a good idea. How that thing go around me, maybe? I really wish I could track these things on the map. Safe. If they're invisible, that means when I'm fighting other enemies like this, I can't focus on them. Which makes things much trickier than it should be. I don't think that one's gonna come down. Either. That one over there might. Okay, let's try this. Yeah, this looks like a success. So it looks like I found out the layout of that room. Aha! Mapping. If I turn this way, it lags less. I guess this could be an advantage to my strafing. I could use it to try and dodge lag. Please don't be locked. Thank you! Gah! Alright, I'm running out of power, so I can't afford to put him to sleep. So, let's use attack powers. Nope, can't use your powers. Oh no. Oh yeah! Perfect. Looks like a good time to heal. Uh, yeah, one more. It's still cheaper to heal using that than Sal. Aha! Nothing there. Hmm. Alright, I think this is an area where a shortcut might appear. Let's check this wall. Aha! Walk through the forest, a wall of trees blocks your progress. Continue forth, yes! Shortcut! Alright, this looks like a good point for me to stop. I can go back to town and I can rest and sell all that stuff. Alright, set off trading. Sell all this gum hides. Hey, I can make an iron glove. Soft horns. Broadaxe! Tachi! 
open cap, color fur, pedal coat, mufflers, and looks like some old stuff, Cora, steel coat, or stud coat, bird whip, and it doesn't look like anything else. I can also now sell this hard ass boost because I'm not going to use a protector, but I'll deal with my selling and buying stuff later. For now, it's time to nap. Next time, let's play Etrian Odyssey 2. More exploring! Later, adventurers! I said save! Save!